This is going to be a bit of an old start. I think. I haven't started this. I'm going to have to probably check my YouTube channel. Because I will have... It would guide me in some way, but um, I don't think I've started this car for about five, five months or so, maybe. Something like that. Pretty sure it was in the fall. I don't remember what fucking keys do it or what? Okay. Um, yeah, I know it's got a bit of gas, but like I say, I have not turned it over or whatever, so who the hell knows. I also have a camera on the uh, gas saver gauge. I'll, if it all works out, I'll put it picture in picture kind of thing. This here is a little sketchy, so it, when the car starts, it's going to wobble like fuck and probably look stupid. So that may not happen. You might not get to see that. And yeah, probably girl doesn't get a lot of love in these days, but it's not too bad. It's kind of wet in here because this thing does have some leaks, but you know what I'm going to do. I am still giving some serious thought to taking this engine out, put in the red. I don't know when I'm going to start that because that's once you start a task like that, you're uh, you committed yourself, or you're just going to wind up with two cars with no fucking engine. And uh, I am able to notoriously uh, talk myself of self out of working. Uh, the, the weather's going to have to be nice too. There's no way to do it in this fucking terrible shit. But anyway, I'm giving that some thought. I know it's not a great idea. I know it would leave this car with no fucking engine, but maybe I'll slapdash rebuild that. Um, what was I calling her? The, uh, the mistress. The mistress slant there. And uh, maybe put it together and cram it in here. You know, I was thinking about putting it together and putting it in the red, but I think this thing, I, I like the way this engine operates, so uh, I really would like to have the most reliable thing. Uh, for my very first uh, by-myself engine rebuild, reliability is, uh, is of unknown. Um, when I do, you know, when I do something like that, I try to do it right. But, uh, you know, the first time you do anything, it's, it takes three times as long. And also, you, you know, you end up skipping some steps or you didn't know, or, um, you know, that came out of some 68 truck or whatever. So yeah, who knows? Um, if I were really handy, I would convert one of the cars, probably the red one to, uh, use the truck, uh, uh, four speed. That would be fucking awesome. But that's, you know, and you got to cut a hole. I might as well cut a hole in this one if I'm going to do that. Anyway, I'm going to stop gabbing. We'll see what happens. Felt decent. I'm not getting any movement on the uh, which wouldn't make sense because that would mean there's like zero vacuum but if I had to guess um, my guess is that the points are uh, no this has a this has a magnetic trimming I put that in it's kind of sounding like uh, well, it's also sounding like it's not getting fuel which is very likely Oh, the needle is moving a bit. Got a sunk, yep. <laughs> Even when this thing sat for two years outside the studio there, when I had it up on the jack stands, it started way quicker than this. Oh, there you go. Rattle. Struggling. Oh, oh. It's going to stall. No two ways about it. That was a pretty hard start, but... It's been sitting here and getting frozen the last couple of weeks. It's been uh, pretty below zero. 
not this week so much it's raining it's gone back to rain now but it's gonna stay needles not wobbling it's like it's not pulling a great vacuum right now but at least it's steady Calls that in the good range, but I can still hear it, like it's struggling. Oh, I did it to myself. Maybe I just let her out a little, warm up, and be somebody. Still, I can't be too disappointed with that, now can I? Go down. Oh, 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 oh. the way the uh, vacuum responds when I let off it'll go it'll peg the gauge that's just the nature of how the vacuum system works anyway no worries this thing will you know it'll warm up no problem oh yeah right fuck every time I start this thing I get reminded of all the crap that I left undone last time and that's what I'm getting at. I don't want to start an engine swap on something and then uh, just, you know, oh, oh, Jesus Christ, it's all over the map. It's unhappy. Oh. Oh, yeah. That was interesting. Let's try and get the choke back on. pretty like once it's happy it's it's pretty good at settling down last thing it needs more leaks than it already has anyway really I can't uh, can't be too disappointed with that did have to crank it a lot more than I thought uh, I might but been some pretty inclement weather and you know it's just been sitting here for a long time freezing away i was more shocked at how quickly uh it started up when it had been sitting for two years that kind of blew my mind a little bit because i'll bet you it took five crank or you know five actual revolutions and just came up and it was about as happy as this uh, right is now anyway uh, not earlier so anyway that's uh that doesn't prove much but still starts not really showing much gas anymore, so like I better not go too far. I'm not going anywhere today, but bunch of wipers don't work. That's not good. Enough. Temperature hasn't come off the peg at all, so get my the lights work. Oh, great! The lights do work. That fucking dash ain't screwed in. Yeah, that'll be another video. Anyway, I guess uh, yeah. That's not massive excitement, but uh, yeah, some people like to come along for a start. I watched uh, 
Tyler's neighborhood garage the other day. Um, you know, obviously a uh, a kindred spirit with all those Valiants and Dodge Chrysler stuff. He was out starting his. Uh, I can't remember if it's that '68 or '69. No, maybe it's a six. Uh, I can't remember what the hell it is. Anyway, he had his uh, his uh, Ford Valiant there in uh, 12, to 12 Fahrenheit. <laughs> temperatures and it did pretty goddamn well. He was saying that uh, his choke spring or whatever isn't strong enough or whatever and uh, I definitely had to find a, a new old stock one for the red one. Yeah, because those those Chinese things they don't they don't put out. Right? The, the, spring, the spring is just not strong enough to do its job. So, uh, yeah. So that, that, was, that was fun to see. Will she start? Anyway, as Gold War Motor says, she's a runner. I will talk to you all soon. Uh, please have a good day and um, yeah we'll chat soon bye